Hello guys and welcome to uh, an unexpected uh, Doctor Who review and today uh, I'm going to be reviewing uh, not a book, not a DVD, but a Big Finish audio and this Big Finish audio is the incredibly well-known Doctor Who story Scherzo or Skirzo, I don't know how uh, you really pronounce it but I think a lot of people call it Scherzo. Um, so yeah, this is written by the legend that is Rob Sherman who is one of the most highly regarded writers for uh, Doctor Who, Big Finish uh, wise. Um, it's a shame he doesn't really uh, do much, uh, where well, he sort of stepped away from Doctor Who a little bit these days which is a shame, but um, I'd love to see him come back and uh, do more Big Finish stories and uh, hopefully maybe one day he'll come back to write a TV story because obviously Dalek was great and Jubilee, again, fantastic and um, I've still yet to listen to quite a few of his stories but anyway, without uh, more rambling, let's crack on and let's uh, dive straight in with the sort of overview of the products and then I'll go into my full thoughts and opinions in the next half of the video. So yes, without any further ado, let's start. So of course, uh, we've got a very nice cover, it's a very simple cover, it's just uh, pretty much white with uh, the Doctor and Charlie holding hands, which is uh, one of the scenes in the story, and as you can see it stars uh, Paul McGann and India Fisher as Charlie. Um, and it says full cast audio drama on a double CD, so um, that's that. And then you've got the spine, uh, Doctor Who, Scherzo, and this is release number 52. And then you've got the back here with um, the uh, cast, well, a bit of the cast and then the blurb. So I'll, I'll just read you the blurb. There are two friends and together they travelled the cosmos. The thwarted tyrants and defeated monsters, they righted wrongs wherever they went. They explored the distant future and the distant past. New worlds and galaxies, places beyond imagining. But every good story has to come to an end. With no times or places left to explore, all the two friends have now are each other. But maybe that's one voyage too many. Maybe they'll discover the things they rather have left undisturbed. In the way, in the suffocating, unfeeling, deafening brightness. Once upon a time, far, far away. So yes, that's the blurb. Really nice blurb there. And if we open it up, we've got um, the booklet uh, with production notes and cars, pictures. And we've got um, two discs. So I won't uh, show you what's, what the other discs look like because it's just pretty much the same. Um, one thing I do will say about these older releases is that I really don't like these um, plain discs a bit a bit like the original classic DVD releases is because basically I'm worried that one day it's going to get scratched and it means I won't um, ever listen to this beautiful um, audio properly again uh, which hopefully I'm trying my best not to scratch it because um, that would be horrible um, so that's why I'm not particular a big fan of uh, these old releases. Um, so now let's crack on to my thoughts and opinions of Scherzo, written by Rob Sherman. Okay, so Scherzo, or Skirzo, however you want to pronounce it. Um, oh, it's, a, it's a fantastic uh, Doctor Who story, and if you know your Big Finish, you'll know that it is one of the most famous Big Finish stories, because a lot of Rob Sherman's uh, stories are quite well known in the uh, Big Finish listeners community um, because uh, he's just one of those writers who's got a really he's really gifted when it comes to writing Doctor Who because he really knows you can tell he's a really big fan of the show and um, whenever he writes a Doctor Who script it's guaranteed uh, it's going to be brilliant because I think I think a lot of people would agree that there's probably not a single Robert Sherman's script that is considered as bad I mean like I said before I haven't listened to every single Rob Sherman story, I mean there, there's not that many um, because some of them are quite hard to get hold of like uh, The Charms of Midnight um, which I, I planned to get a few years ago but um, it, unfortunately it was out of stock on uh, Amazon and um, I was really gutted because that was a release that I really wanted um, I'm glad that they sort of released it on um, uh, vinyl uh, but uh, it's quite expensive, it's about 80 quid roughly if I'm not mistaken 
Um, so yes, this is the uh, 50 second release from Big Finish, uh, starring Paul McGann and India Fisher. And this is basically the first of like a four linked uh, story. Um, and they follow directly from the events of uh, Zagreus. Um, it's a four part story and they're roughly about 25 to 30 minutes long each. Um, and it's sort of composed of the original theme music and uh, between each uh, uh, episode and of course there are cliffhanger endings. Um, it's two episodes per disc as well and uh, of course there's a short booklet with some pictures and stuff as you've seen in my little product review of it. Um, now basically as for the story um, it's a really I think it's a really psychological story. It's very clever. It's um, it just features the Doctor and Charlie in this sort of um, I'm trying to find a way to describe it. It's a really uh, they're basically in another universe, and it's, there's this sort of creature that can um, basically it doesn't know. I think it doesn't know the full sort of sense senses so you've got uh, touch taste um, and all the others uh, it's it's really quite difficult to explain um, and I think this is when uh, Big Finish uh, tried to do something different and experimental uh, with the Eighth Doctor um, and basically because a lot of the Eighth Doctor adventures have just been straightforward and easy to listen to um, whereas this one this is quite quite different um, because um, basically the Doctor and Charlie they land in this different universe and there's a sort of blinding light and the Doctor can see but um, of course Charlie isn't really accustomed to this uh, well her whole, because she's human, she's not really accustomed to this uh, new environment, this new universe and so she's struggling to adapt to that through, throughout most of the story and um, yeah there's uh, times when uh, the characters, you know, start repeating themselves, and then that becomes part of the story as well. Um, it's really quite psychological, and um, like I said, it only features the Doctor and Charlie, so it's just Paul McGann and India Fisher carrying this uh, audio adventure along, and they do a fantastic job. It's one of their best performances, I think. It's one of Big Finish's most finest works, and. Um, one of the reasons I wanted to get this is because of the fact it's um, so highly regarded and I'm quite glad I did because it's so great and so fantastic that um, it's simply unmissable I think and you pretty much have to get it if you are listening to Big Finish and you haven't listened to this story um, I highly recommend you get it um, but it is set in the Divergent Universe uh, well actually no it's uh, yeah it is Divergent Universe um, and um, Basically, it's the possibility of uh, infecting our universe with anti-time, and this story pretty much um, uh, is sort of the consequence consequences of their actions. It shows the consequences um, of them being in that universe, and um, and it really plays with their perceptions and senses. And it's a really about the story is really about the Doctor's relationship with Charlie and how that's. Uh, progressing and how um, it really tests them to the limit at some time, well sometimes during the story um, and it's a real character driven piece, a real character sc uh, study um, and it shows what it means to be a companion of the Doctor and why he has companions and why they want to travel with him um, and it also ex explores the possibilities of this new universe um, with different laws and properties of our own which I think is a really interesting idea. Um, so yes, thank you very much for watching my review of Scherzo. Um, I'd probably give this uh, story a 10 out of 10. Um, I think it's just brilliant. It's an absolutely fantastic um, audio release from Big Finish. And like I said, it's one of their finest works they've ever done. So yes, thank you for watching. And uh, I shall see you next time for probably another Big Finish review. So thank you and goodbye.